Hi, friends. It's me. How's it going? I know. Who am I? Making videos. Like, I, it's like it's a thing I do. So, we're doing Currently Inked. And the spoiler is I only have one pen currently inked. Was that true? No, that's a lie. I have other pens currently inked. Hold on. Okay, actually, I was going to call this one Currently Inked, but it's empty. Hooray! That feels good. Um... I get to clean a pen, yay. And I have this one still currently inked. The observant among you may remember this from, I don't know, it's probably 30 inks. This is uh, Earl Grey Tea. This is one of the pens that I forgot to include in my pen video. I own this pen. It's the Moon Man, what is it, Q1? Who knows? On, on, on uh, Amazon, they called it a little fat man. <laughs> <laughs> which I loved. Anyway, I've been using it. Even though it's not like my favorite color of ink. So we'll include it today. But because, oh, and this is almost empty too. It's down to there. So it's practically empty. So as a result... I don't, you know what, I'm not going to include these because I don't remember the name of the ink in this. This is an ink mint one. And the book is somewhere else and I'm not looking. So, essentially, I don't have any pens inked, which means I need to ink pens. Hurrah! So, these are two new inks that you may have seen me do a video about. And I was like, Maria, you have all these samples and you never use samples. So... I'm using some samples. Feel good. And I picked pens already to go with the inks. Who am I, right? I'm like almost organized. So, this is from that video. The color is not accurate, but ooh. Can I just, hi. I'll be back. Oh, this is the pen. This is the ink that's in the um this pen. It's like I don't know, day three or five or something of ink vent. Nightfall. I think that's the name of it. But am I gonna bet on it? Hmm. Should I put it here or should I put it in the back? What do we think? Wait. Okay, not a bad sign. I mean, I don't think I'm gonna get more ink to go on here. Am I gonna get new ink next week? Probably not. Let's just put it here. Okay, so we'll do currently inked right here. And I guess we'll start with um, the one that, you know what? I really am like irritated with myself because I have to go look up that other ink now. I'm, I'm forcing myself to. To be honest, I'm kind of irritated with myself for making me go do this. How do I not have a currently inked for it? Well, where are we? Oh, I was right, y'all. It's nightfall. Good job, me. Okay. So I don't have my normal setup because things are not set up. We're going to say... Currently inked. So this is Twisby Eco Transparent Blue, the broad nib, Thiamine 
Nightfall, which was Ink Vent 2023. It's so sparkly. This was Love at First Sight. And I do still like this ink. I filled it pretty full. Should we try and zoom you? Sorry it's at an angle. Do I have, wait, and I have seven inks. <gasps> Wild. And we have, we're gonna call the Q1, cause why not? Moon Man Q1 with a medium nib. Pretty sure it's medium. Um, and this is Dominant Industry Earl Grey Tea. Oh, the blue for my thing got in there. Okay. Cool. That's it. That's everything that's currently inked. Bye. Okay. But for realsies, no fakies. This is dangerous. I took the cover off this. Let's get to inking. So I'm going to ink up my Just Be Go with probably a broad nib. I mean, that looks pretty broad. Um, with, what do you think? I mean, right? The 2024 Blue Dragon Glistening Blue. Because I really have come to appreciate Blue Dragon, the goes for anything with shimmer. I put, um, Strigoi in my Eco Tea and Regret. <laughs> I think I'm only ever going to put that in a Twisby Go or a similar sort of pen where I can easily take the thing apart to clean the inside. So potentially something like uh, Back 700. Um, I could do that. Now we have to be very neat because... I don't have anything on the counter. And I regret saying that because perfect, perfect. No ink got in the pen. No ink got anywhere. That's at least something. I mean, these little bottles, my neck is so narrow. Oh, fuck. Oh my God, I said a bad word. I'm so, oh shit. It's getting worse. I'm making it worse. Oh my God. Oh, please. Okay, everything's fine. Sorry about that, everyone. Don't tell, okay? Don't tell. Did it get worse before it got better? Yes, my friends, yes. Yes, it did. <laughs> we <laughs> did all of you go, no, why would you say that? Oh my god, wait, I'm not done. I'm not done. There's more. When I did when I jinxed myself, did all of you just shudder? Because you should have. Okay, we're in business. <laughs> I hate myself right now. What are we even filming? <laughs> this is the chaos you've come to expect, I hope. Okay, so we have the Twisby Go Sapphire 
the broad nib and color verse 24 blue dragon glistening I'm just gonna put G okay but we'll both know what that means I'm gonna have to find my, my, my dive remover. I need another thorough clean. Okay. <laughs> it's juicy right now. I did even like burp it, you know, like where you remove one fill. Okay. That's <laughs> set it set. Now, for something completely different. This pen. <laughs> so this is my, uh, uh, look, I don't know. It's some kind of pen with a nib, okay? <laughs> it's my Platinum 3776 Nice Pure with a medium nib. Is it a medium nib? Yeah. What happened to those paper towels I had a moment ago? Ink on top of the paper, on top of the paper towels. <laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm losing it. I'm losing it. This has been a rough. I think it's just been a very rough time, and, and I'm punchy and just finding delight in the ridiculous. Because if you don't laugh, you might cry, right? Laughing is way more fun than crying. Source, me, I do both a lot. Okay. Great. Oops, just let the ink go. I want to get in around this collar here. Soak up some of that. Yeah. Okay. So I thought I wanted this ink in a dryer pin and I thought, hmm, maybe this one. So we'll see. I'm successful. Because I don't love how the sheen can overtake it. So this is my... Platinum 3776, nice, pure, with a medium nib, with color verse, oops, 2024, blue dragon, swipe left. Um, So even though this, I mean, it's a juicy pen, even though it's fine. So you can see the sheen is overtaking. But you can see that base color now that I've smushed it out. Smushed it, smeared it. Smush it, smear it. Ink it. Ink it, clean it, smush it, smear it. Te Technologic. Okay. Now we're gonna mix it up.
I picked the inks first, by the way, and then the pens. So this is my Newton Pens Prospector. I like to line this section up because it goes glow to glow. It's not like it matches, but it's pretty close. And then also when you do that, the point is opposite of flat and I like that contrast. And the ink I'm gonna put in this mm -hmm, is a sample. Cause I was like, I need to use my samples. And this is Califolio Andrenople or Andrenople. Since I'm not good at French pronunciation anyway, why try, right? You tried and failed. Lesson learned. Never try. I don't believe that, but you know, when there's a Simpsons quote, you kind of got to go with it. Do you know who says that in The Simpsons? Feel free to let me know in the comments. I mean, I know, but you know, do you know? You can kind of see that the ink got in there, maybe you can see that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, now I have technologic stuck in my head. If I've done that to you too, well, at least we're in good company. So, pretty sure I got this with a medium nib because I was like, let's mix it up. Oh, okay, that's all right. Um, because I was going broad for a while, and then I was like, let's let's do some mediums so I have variety. So this is Newton pens. Prospector medium, and this is a glow stick. The material, I'm, I'm pretty sure. Califolio, I think it's two L's, but whatever. We're here now. Andre no. It's a really nice magenta. I'd like my hair to be that color. <clears throat> and then the next two are samples from friends. So first up is the first ever ink sample I got, I think, if I'm not mistaken. And I'm gonna put it in this pen. And in fact, this is like the Manda pairing, although the sample is not from Manda, but from my good friend, Sarah. Delightful human. I had to get a new body for this because it had like a crack in it. And I'm hopeful that it writes better now. So the ink we're going with, I actually have a bottle, but I'm choosing to use the sample if I can get it to stir. Let's just vigorously shake. That's not what you really want to do with your ink. But the gentle rolling wasn't working. This is Jacques Herbin, Matisse, De Lural. Let me know if I pronounced that correctly. If you know, thanks. Okay. 
I like that this has like a, a halo around it of like darker color. You come in focus. No, such is life. We have Twisby Eco Transparent Purple with a broad nib. And this ink is I'm looking for J Hair Bomb. Amethyst from the Ural Mountains, everybody. Look at that. That's nice. My little Exante like, got kind of mixed in with the E. That's all right. It's looking weaker than I remember it. I should have examined it more closely. It's not a fresh sample. And then for our last ink, my new slash not new pen, Twisby Eco Tea in Rosso, Rosso. And This is Manda made me do it. Manda gave me a sample of Sailor's Warning. So I'm gonna put it in this pen. Well, or I'm gonna fail to put it in this pen. Would it really be an inking video if at least one pen didn't fail to ink, right? Would this even be my channel if I successfully inked every pen? I say no. Almost all of it. GG me. This is actually a pretty good match for it, though Taylor's Warning is a bit more orange. I may have gotten ink on my sleeve, but I don't care. So. Frisbee Eco T Rosso. I think I got this with a medium. I thought I was going to get it broad, but maybe I didn't. Um, Diamine Sailor's Warning. Perfect little squigglies. And not at all chaotic currently inked. This is one of the most chill videos I've ever made and there was no chaos at any point. Right? Thanks. There. Isn't this pretty? Yeah. Um, let's zoom out. <laughs> okay. Here's my currently inked. What do we think? I'm excited. I don't love the collection of pins together. They're not like a pleasing assortment. And actually, nor the inks. But individually, I'm quite satisfied with what I've chosen. So like the palette, eh, whatever. Um, but in the sense, it's good because I'll have some variety. Uh, yeah.
which of these would be your favorite? Which of these would, would if you were going to put one of them into your pen rotation this month, which one would it be? All right, uh, let me know. I hope whenever you're watching this, you're having a wonderful day. Maybe play with some pens and ink. Take care of yourselves. Bye.